Hi guys, in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the newly released Laura Mercier lipsticks. They are called the High Vibe Lip Colours and they are available in 16 shades. I have five of them here and I'll do swatches on the back of my hand and I'll also be doing some lip swatches as well. Now on the Laura Mercier website, they say that these are a modern formula that applies a fabulous vivid coat of colour with a melting sensation. An immediate release of high resolution pigments brings your lips to life in 16 energetic shades. And I did swatches of these lipsticks for Instagram and from the swatches that I did, and I've also worn one of the lipsticks as well, they are really pigmented and they are a very moisturizing formula as well. So they go on to say that imagine your lips coming to life with the most alive and vivid color. High vibe lip glides sensuously onto lips, delivering impactful vivid color in just one effortless stroke. Supercharged pigments and light reflecting vivid pearls boost color vibrancy, while guava oil ensures a comfortable smooth wear for six hours. So again, you've got these new release lipsticks that have these oil infused ingredients in them and they do make them really, really lovely. And again, it just says they're offered in 16 high energy colors inspired by Laura Mercier's vision that a touch of color can brighten your life. And these lipsticks are quite high pigment. So they go on and give usage tips for them as well. If you don't want as much coverage, it says you can just dot a little bit on your lips and then blend that out just to get the color even and you get less pigment. Or you can just swipe and press. And they say that's for a medium coverage. And then they talk about the line and apply for a high coverage, more defined lip look. Line lips with a complementary shade of long wear lip liner before, after the high vibe application. So let's take a look at the packaging of these. These come in this really, it's a really pretty type of packaging. Now, one thing to note with these is they aren't very heavy in the hand. They aren't ultra lightweight, but I'm sort of comparing it to, say, the Victoria Beckham, those posh lipsticks, and I've pulled one out of the drawer. So this is the Slimline lipstick from Victoria Beckham Beauty, and I'm just going to put it side by side, the Laura Mercier. So it is a little bit shorter than the Laura Mercier ones. Now, the Victoria Beckham one definitely feels more weighty in the hand than these Laura Mercier ones. The Victoria Beckham lipsticks, they sell for $38 US dollars each, and these Laura Mercier ones, they sell for $32 each. So we've got 120, the color Joy. Then we've got 122, and that is the shade Like. Then there's number 123, and that is Blaze. And number 140 is Buzz. And number 160 is Glow. So I'm just holding up so you can take a close look at it. And despite it being lighter than the Victoria Beckham one, I think the packaging itself is really, really pretty. And it's very simple, but it just has the Laura Mercier wording down the side. And they just have the pull off lid and then you twist the lipstick up and it can be twisted down as well and it does have a slight click when you roll it down so i'll stop talking and the click is quite soft so i'm not sure whether you'll be able to hear it and then when you put the lid back on there is one click and it has the two clicks to completely close it so now i'm going to swatch these on the back of my hand I'm going to do them in the number order. Now, I also did swatches of these in natural light for Instagram. So hopefully, to the left of me, a picture will pop up of those. So here we have 120, and this is Joy. Next is 122, that is the shade Like. Then we've got 123, and that is Blaze. Second to last is 140, and that is the shade Buzz. 
and the last one is 160 and that is the shade glow and on the Laura Mercier website these first three shades she puts them under the pink category and then she puts number 140 under the mauve category and number 160 she puts under the coral category so I'm just going to take the shade this is the first one number 120 joy and I just want to show you what sort of pigmentation that you get with one swipe and then two so this is just with one swipe so it is very pigmented and then we'll go over it again and you'll get even more so they are very pigmented lipsticks so that's why under the details of how to use these if you want a lighter application that's why she says you can just dot it on your lips and then spread it around that way and you'll get lighter coverage if that's what you want so as i was saying before i've already worn one of these lipsticks for a day and i used the shade number 120 in joy i think these are a really beautiful lipstick they are what they say they are they're very moisturizing and they feel really lovely on the lips these are easy to apply to because they're just so pigmented. I think they're really lovely. So now I'm going to do some lip swatches and I'm going to start with the shade number 120 in Joy. Number 122 in the shade Like. Number 123 in Blaze. Here I am, I have a plan. I'm living free, don't know where I am. Number 140 in the shade Buzz. And finally, number 160 in the shade Glow. And you can see from the swatches how pigmented these lipsticks are and you would see me sometimes go a couple of times that's because I was taking my time because they are so pigmented I didn't want to go over the line on my lips and make a mess but they definitely are if you press and swipe you definitely get the color payoff these feel really comfortable on the lips as I was saying earlier I have worn the shade Joy that was the lightest one and the first one that I swatched and it probably lasted on me probably between four and five hours. I think if you were having a meal, you'd get quite a lot wearing off. But it does leave a bit of the stain there, which is really nice with a lipstick. And the other four lipsticks today, while I'm doing this video, is the first time that I've put them on. And I really like all the shades that I've put on. And I really like this shade too. I think it's really lovely and it goes really well with the eyeshadow that I'm wearing today. The only thing with these lipsticks is I'm not quite sure why they really need that double click. It is quite satisfying, but it doesn't really give much of a purpose. So I'm just going to close it once. There's the one click, and then you click it again to completely close it. So I was thinking while I was doing my swatches, I wasn't sure whether just after the one click the lid might be still loose and come off but even after just one of the clicks so I'll just do the one click again once you put it upside down the lid is secure and there is no way that it's going to come off it's just that you can use the second click as well having the clicks is very satisfying if that's what you like in a lipstick but I'm just not quite sure 
what the purpose is of the two clicks. But if you decide to buy one of these and worry that you need to double click it for the lid to be secure, you don't need to worry about that just after the one click. And if then if you popped it into your purse, the lid is definitely going to stay on. But overall, I think these are really lovely lipsticks. I think the packaging, despite them being maybe not as heavy as, say, a Victoria Beckham and some other brands out there, I think it is really really pretty. I think the formula of the lipsticks are just beautiful. I think they look gorgeous on my lips. I have much more mature skin. I have a lot more lines in my lips than younger people, but I think these look really beautiful. I think the ingredients that are in these, the moisturizing ingredients, they help to, they're not going to be like a plumping lipstick where they have that tingle or anything like that. But because of the humectants in here and the oils, it definitely helps plump out the lips. And I think it, they just give a really beautiful look. And they do feel really lovely while you're wearing them. And the pigment is just fantastic on them. So overall, I'm really happy with all the five shades that I bought. I think all are really lovely. And I will be reaching for these lipsticks quite a lot. I think that they're really, really lovely. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you next time. Bye.